Then when you mess go, I go. Ah, I want a boyfriend. Not yet. Oh, oh. I want to have more energy, Diallo. Where's the baby? Where's that phone number? Oh, what do you do? What do you do? What do you do? What do you do? The gods are wise. Yes. May the gods be praised. Yes. So, you should be crowned the next king of this kingdom with immediate effect. Yes. If I understand you clearly, you want to make me your queen. And you said your kingdom has chosen you to be the king. Exactly, my princess. You see, I've been longing for a moment like this to tell you how much I admire and love you. Princess, I believe we can get married and rule this kingdom together. Why are you trying to take advantage of the fact that I am not in good terms with your friend? Well, I will not be your queen. I am not interested to be your wife. I don't even like you at all. And I am not a cheap lady you think you can deceive. I am not. A rookie cannot be your husband. What? See, princess. I am not deceiving you. I am not. Chidi doesn't deserve you. He doesn't deserve you. It's not good for you. It's not. See, I believe it's the will of the gods that both of you have these issues so that you can be my queen. And see, princess, all you need to do is to accept me. Let's do things together immediately. Okay, look at this bead on my hand. It's royalty. It's a royal bead. I will be crowned the next king of my kingdom in two days' time. Please, be my queen. Get lost. I am not interested. Princess? Princess! By the powers bestowed on me as the Ono of Diala Kingdom, I ask you to make your last wish. I have come to realize that rape is bad. Rape is a very bad thing. And I honestly regret my actions. I regret my actions. Therefore, let me use this very opportunity to advise my fellow youth out there. Never, never to get involved in rape. It's a very bad thing, though. Hey! And I pray, may the gods forgive me and accept 
my soul. Indeed, may the gods forgive you and have mercy on your soul. Because you have committed an offense against the law of the land on rape, and you have been duly sentenced. Today marks your last day on earth. You shall be executed by hanging, and your body, your corpse, thrown into the evil forest. God, your Highness, take it. Your Highness, let me spare. Hey, 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 Oh no. Honestly, I feel so bad right now. I mean, I feel so bad right now because our dear friend Nebuka will not get out of this trauma. Hmm. It's here, Ibe. It's here, Ibe. Come on. Hi. has exercised the strongest and unbending law in the history of our land. After all our plea, after all we said, hey. Anyway, it's not his fault. But Ibe, can you imagine? I watched the son of my best friend, my old school mate, murdered in cold blood. I'm not sure I will get out of this shock. I'm not sure. Hey, Ewa! What is it? What is it? Speak! What is it? The bear cannot has hung himself. Eh? What? Where? Do it himself. Ow! Hey, let's go. Hey! Ah, abomination. Hey, it's here. I was just talking of how I will be able to recover from the shock of his son being murdered in cold blood. And then this one. Hi! Hey! Ichi, will I ever come out of this? Let's, let's go out. See the chief priest. My legs cannot carry me anymore. Ah. Hey. 
wicked will land there. Hey! Who's that? Who are you? Who's that? Stop it! Uh, hey! Yeah, it's how, me. How did you get here? Oh. I mean, what are you doing here? It's your home. It's my home. It's our home. Whenever Mrs. Yak comes around to see you. Mm-hmm. <laughs> ah. Hey, come on. Come. Chili, what are you doing? Shin, come on. I want yeah. to be with you. I want to hold you. Come on. What is wrong with you? Hey, stop. come behave. Come on. Oh. I said stop it. It's okay. Stop. Hey, stop. you come here. Chidi, you're hurting me. Where do you think you're going? Do you know you're hurting me? Can you, you just... with me. Don't go. I said stop it. Just let me go. What is wrong with you? Hey. Come here. Oh. Come here. What is my presence? How are you, Chimo? I'm doing fine, my presence. Um, how's your mother's health? She's getting better by his grace, my presence. Mm. That's good to know. Please, if she needs anything, do not hesitate to let me know. Oh, thank you very much. I really appreciate my presence. You're I will. Welcome. Thank you. Good day, my princess. Good day. Um, are you okay? Yes, I'm okay. Do you need anything? No. No. 
I don't need anything. Okay, my princess. Joe, my son, pick one of the maidens and make her your queen. We have beautiful maidens in this kingdom. Your coronation is by the corner. We don't have time. Nazi, uh, I will suggest we we'll have this discussion in Joe's house. Chidi, my son, whoever that wants to become the king of this kingdom, this palace becomes his house. So we're in the right place. Okay. Father, I am interested in someone. The princess, right? She doesn't want you, and we cannot keep waiting. Father, this is my kingdom, and whatever I say stands. Now I want you to go with the Jofo to see her father. I have to make her my queen. Listen, Joe, I am an elder. And there's a way we handle this kind of thing. We don't rush into it. Father, uh, everything came suddenly. I know it. <sighs> what? I said I have your mind made up. I will talk to Uja for my friend. We'll talk to her father. But if it doesn't go well. Make up your mind to pick one among the four beautiful maidens in this palace. We don't have time. Put in your best, father. I will try. I, I am the king. I will try. Oh. I, I, I don't understand. A princess. Who is she? You don't know her. Come on, Joe, you've been my friend for a couple of years. There's no single girl you've dated that I, Chidi, do not know. And I said, Chidi, you don't know this particular one. It's okay. It's all right. Okay. But, Joe, I didn't know you want to become the king of your kingdom. You know, knowing the history of your kingdom, anyone who becomes the king Died. Chidi, I am different from every other one that I've died. I am Joe. I will not die foolishly like the way they did. You know what? I want to have my peace. <laughs> Joe, are you indirectly asking me to leave? Joe, look at you. you. You've not even become the king and you're having an attitude. So what happens when he finally becomes one? Oh, Chidi, my friend. I am no longer the Joe you used to know. I am now the king of a kingdom. Get used to it. Oh, hey, funny. You saved me that ugly dream. Do you know the meaning of that dream? Um, my, my princess, you know, I'm not a soothsayer nor a dream interpreter. But with what you said, it's definitely a bad dream. Mm -hmm. Maybe because you watched how Ekene was killed. Mm. Oh, you may be right. 
You may be right. It was really a terrible dream. Who would want to kill you? <laughs> Not just someone. Ah, enough of that. So, tell me about yourself. My princess, my... My story is not a palatable one. Call me Adugo. But you are the princess. I know. But I want you to call me Adugo. It's an order. <laughs> I'm just joking. <laughs> I'm just joking. Oh, let me have it. Thank you. That's my father. Hello, father. Um, yes, um, I'm around. Now? Okay. All right, dad. My father. Oh. He wants to see me now. Okay. Okay, my princess. So, can we do this some other time? Maybe Just... you tell me your story when next I come? Sure. Sure. Thanks for stopping by. Majesty, I greet you. We have heard everything you said. Marino, when a babysitter comes to carry a baby, a newborn baby, and eventually the child dies, what else will he do or she do? She has to go. We've heard your royal message and we will take it directly to our prospective king. Well, it's all right. Uh, I must confess that uh, that your deep proverb took me off balance. <laughs> but I know that you meant well. Yes. Uh, I have to commend you for understanding with me. You know, two things I cherish so much in your life are my daughter's uh, peace and happiness. You know, I can't trade them for anything. All right. So, like I said, uh, my daughter is happily engaged, and in no time, she will be getting married. Okay. So, uh, I must apologize if uh, I have disappointed you. No, 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 Hello, we my will friend. Have again for you. Thank you. Also, thank you very much. You're welcome. Yes, please. My regards to your incoming king. Oh, thank you very much. Yeah, that's it. Thank you. Thank you. My uh, king, I will be happy to come. It's okay. Hello, please. Please uh, sit down. Oh, oh no, my oh, friend. Oh, my friend. <laughs> You're welcome. Thank you. Thanks, Kim. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Don't tell me you've been withdrawn. I had no choice, Dad. <laughs> but Dad, yes. you did so well. I know. But Dad, please can you not tell people that I'm about to get married? 
please sit down. Sit. So, my angel, why did you say that? Dad, I just don't want you to tell people. Could it be because of the dream you had? Dad, please. Please, Dad. It's alright. I just want you to be happy. Okay? Thank you. Chiamaka. Chiamaka. Chiamaka, you are here fighting and killing yourself over a king. Princess Adugo, yes, our princess, is falling in love with him. Shut, Shut that your mouth. You always have something to say in this palace. Why? Why is your mouth always running? Shoo, 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 every time. Don't you have good things to do with yourself? How is that even possible? Eh? You see? You see, Guinea? Do you listen to yourself when you talk? Do you hear yourself talk? That you, 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 you always sound stupid most of the time you speak. The princess you and I know is getting married to Chidi. How is it even possible that she will fall in love with an ordinary Akarasela? Ordinary Akarasela? Is that... Are you, are, you, are you not crazy? Are you mad? Is something wrong with you? You just be saying nonsense from your mouth. Chiamaka. Mm. Chiamaka. Chiamaka. How many times did I call you? I am giving you the latest updates. I am telling you what is going on in this palace. Eh? Are we not just coming back from his house? The princess and I. I don't believe you. Ah, you talk a lot. I can never believe you. There is no way I can believe you. I cannot believe it. It is not even possible. You are lying. In fact, you are the, you're, you're, you're the biggest, fattest liar I've met in my life. Eh. It is a lie. Pure lie. Big fat lie. Eh. Mm. Okay. Uh -uh. So what do you know? No problem. Mm -hmm. Eh? Be here telling me that I am a big fat liar. Till this big fat lie will turn into a big fat truth. Then your eyes will clear. Hmm? If I let me tell you, hmm? Ikim is no longer your class. Yes. Ikim has upgraded. He's no longer your class and that of Neka. Then he's of your belly will be fat like It's not true. Never. Ordinary Akarasela, princess. This can never be true. The next time you call me, tell me what you're out. Oh no. Ebuka killed himself, and as such, he will not be buried in the town. Your Majesty, Iti Ebuka was a titled man. I know the tradition, but it... There is no cause for you. I stripped him of that title before he committed suicide. Recall that his son was a rapist. His body was thrown into the evil forest. We signed the law. We promulgated the decree that anyone who is found guilty of 
being a rapist, will be hung in this palace. And that was why his son was hung. Now, if he could not take that and decide to kill himself, that is his business. So his body cannot be buried in the town. By all means, you all can mourn him for all I care. But his body must be thrown into the evil forest. Your Majesty, it's okay. I have to leave now. Well, no, I don't see. I go to your majesty. I go to your majesty. How are you? Very well, and you? Yeah, I'm okay. Uh, so, how is your family? Yeah, thank you. Uh, very well. They are good. What is he doing here? Who are you referring to? Father, I do not want him in this palace anymore. Adugo, what is going on? Eh? You're telling me nothing. I mean, I invited him. You don't tell me anything. So what is going on between two of you? Father, I do not want to see him around me anymore. Ah, come on, my princess. In three days' time, he's coming to ask your hand in marriage. I hear you are frowning at his presence. What is going on? Father, that will not happen. That will never happen. Not me, no way. No way that will happen. My princess. My princess. Why are you walking out of the presence of his majesty? My princess. What is going on? I mean, you're not telling me anything. We had a little misunderstanding, Your Majesty. You call this little misunderstanding? She frowned at your presence? Didn't you see the way she reacted? And you are telling me little misunderstanding? What is it that you are not telling me, Chidi? Good morning, Mama. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Okay. You're welcome. Thank you. Um, I want to buy a car. Ah, ah. You should have sent one of your maidens to come instead of stressing yourself. No, Mama, I want to come myself. Yay! How much do you want to buy? Um, a thousand era for me and His Majesty. No, wait, let me serve that. Oh. No, 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 don't worry, Mama. Mama, don't worry yourself, eh? He came with it. <laughs> How is his majesty? It's fine. Thank you very much. Thank you, Mani. Um, okay, Mama. Take okay. care. Oh, sorry. Bye. 
No, give me that one. Tell my son, your coronation is fast approaching. And we don't have time on our hands. We won't waste much more time again, please. Uh, yes, because of that, that's why we decided to bring this beautiful girl to you. She, she's young, she's intelligent, and we are convinced that she will make a good queen. And very beautiful. Yes. <laughs> um, I've heard you, my elders. Um, thank you all for your efforts. But I'm begging for a little time so I can make her my friend and then got to talk to her. You know how this whole thing works. You don't just have to barge into a girl and then make her your wife. You know, At least know if she has this uh, royal quality to become a queen. Um, I don't know if I can go see her now. Talk with her, you know. Have some little discussion. Let you not look at safe. He's being abandoned. Yes. yes. You are right. Thank you, my You are being a perfect gentleman. <laughs> Thank you. That's my son. Free. Yeah. Yeah. That's my son. I'm talking to her. You may touch her. Yes. Nothing is allowed. Oh, Allah. Man, I don't know. You're not Ikem, is it true that you and Princess Adugu are friends? Where is this one coming? Answer me! Go, go, are, are, are you mad? How dare you raise your voice at me? Are, are, you, are you mental? As what now? Am I your age mate? Why are you asking that question as, as, as my mom or what? Are you, are you people mad in this village? Okay. Let me just give you a hint to what is happening. Princess Adugu has broken up with her lover Chidi. She refused his hand in marriage. Things are not adding up. And I don't just want to believe that it has anything to do with you. I don't want to think it. I, 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 I just don't want to think it. Because it's unbelievable and unimaginable. So how, how did I come into this rubbish you just said now? How is it my business? Okay, let me make it plain to you. Whatever the case is, read my lips again. I, Amaka Olisa, the daughter of the Onowu of this kingdom, will not allow you to be close to Princess Adugo or Neka. Uh-uh, it will not work. Never would you want to pet. Is the way you always say like we 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 we, we have anything in common. We have all. How brazen. Are, are you mad? We have, on my life. We have, what business do we have together? We have all. Are we you have. mad in this village? Let it not be what I'm thinking. Is relationship by Let force? Let it not be what I'm thinking. I don't want to imagine it. Is relationship by we force? Have, oh, we have all. Is relationship by force? Let me see how you become close. Let me see. Oh, are you... You must be very mad. You must be raving mad. Okay, I, I know what. So where, 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 what, the, what, where are you coming from? What are you feeling like now? What do you want? What are you doing here? I heard that the princess visits you in this house and also in the shop. She has refused to marry Chidi. And because of that, the palace is in disarray now. This is the English you learned, disarray. So how is it my business now? This rubbish. Come, I'll start slapping you people. Oh. I heard 
I was told that you are seeing the princess of this kingdom. It better not be true. It better not be true. Come on, Seba, come on, see the rope also. Are you people mad? Are you people mad? Chalupa. Chalupa. So it has gotten to this. It has gotten to you pushing me, Ikem. <laughs> you want to play with my emotions. Ikem, you want to play with my emotions, right? Don't worry. Ngeti, teli, ijali, nene, na this village. I will bring out the devil for you. In this village, you will see him live and direct. Come back. Come, Come back. back. Where are you going? Follow me. I mean it, Chidi. I am done. I am done with this relationship. I will never marry you. It's not going to be possible. It will never happen. Why, princess? Why do you want to mess up my plans? I'm sorry, but I'm not messing up your plans. Oh, wait a minute. I want to find out something. Are you seeing someone else lately? Come off it, Chibi. Come off it. Wait, I, uh, something is ringing a bell in my head right now and I want to get to the bottom of it. Does this your decision have anything to do with Joe? Because I remembered vividly that Joe said to me that he wants a princess for a queen. And that very princess refused to accept his proposal. Wait, I'm trying to put one on one together here. Is there something I'm not getting here? Now let me ask you this question. Are you a rapist? What? You heard me. Have you assaulted or molested a girl in your life? Hey! hey. Listen and listen real good. I don't know what you want to achieve with this accusation. I don't know where you're heading to. I don't... What's the meaning of this question? Listen, let me make it clear to you. You are mine and you are mine forever. I don't... Whatever you want to achieve, you can never leave me. You can never dump me. You are mine and you are mine. Amaka, as it stands now, we have one common enemy. I am done fighting with you over Ikem. Mm. Mm. Popongwa is done fighting with you because I don't want anything to dent my skin. You see that anger in your heart, that hatred in your heart, channel it on the princess because she's the one snatching him from you. And spare me that trash. Spare me that nonsense talk. How about you? No? Are you not saying Ikem? No, aren't you saying Ikem? So why are you blabbing? What's all this? That was then, not now. Mm. Look at this one. I am telling you, giving you an advice that will help your life. Opening your all eyes on me. Nah. You see this your color eyes. You are opening it on the wrong person. Go and shine it on the princess. If not, you will remain here and be speaking big, big English. Aren't you? Aren't you? Aren't you? The princess will lick you. Came. Angi, you will be left with nothing. You will be left with an empty place. No ikem for you. Nothing. Don't ever ask to go. You go. Princess, 
And so what if she's the princess? Eh? So what? I am the Onowu's daughter. The Onowu of this kingdom and I can get what I want anytime, anywhere. Princess, my foot. Yeah! I'm gonna take care of you tonight, you know. Make you feel like a queen. Go down for me. Yeah! Jesus! Ah! <laughs> 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 what are you doing here? How did you get into my palace? Why did you tell Princess Adugo about my past? Why did you tell her? What are you doing with the gun? Uh, put the gun down, okay? Put it down. I, I, I never said I never said anything like that. I I, I swear. Yes. But I, I I never said anything like that. I can never do that. No. Please, please, please calm down. Yo. You think because you are like you can deny me my happiness? You think because you are now a king, you can destroy my relationship? Yo. Yo, you are here enjoying your queen! No, no, no! Can you think you can destroy my own relationship? Yo! No, 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 don't do this. I understand what you're saying, but calm down. Let's talk like a man. It's not what you think. It's not what you think. I I, I swear, it's not what you think. Yes, no. Please don't do this. Wait, wait, wait! No, no one wants you. Who is your friend? Who? Who is your No more words from you. Who is your friend? Me? Your friend? Listen, I listen to your God, Joe. No one can stop me from having my happiness. No one can stop me from having a do. Not you, no man, no king, no prince, no one. Show me a strong man. Show me your heart. 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 Show me your heart
the voice. Please, eh? mm -hmm. hey, listen. Please listen to me. We understand your plan. This is totally confusing. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The chief priest fortified him. Mm -hmm. We know that. Yeah. And he equally told us that that king, Janike, mm -hmm. was cursed. Mm -hmm. hey. And of course, of course, mm -hmm. Umana Yuise mm -hmm. went ahead and slept with late King Jamike's wife without waiting for her to complete her mourning period. That was exactly what killed him. Mm -hmm. Now look at, look at Mazudo's only son, Joe, mm -hmm. died of uh, Listen, let me tell you something. The whole thing is quite confusing. We don't know what to do. We are going to must find out. Listen, Edas, mm -hmm. let me tell you something. I have lost complete faith on that so-called chief priest. In fact, he is completely incompetent. I've lost faith in him. I'm joking. That is what, that is what happened. <laughs> okay. As a more, I am not, I am not sure I should call you as a more or eye of the gods. Because you are neither of them. Mm -hmm. Tell me what is happening in this kingdom. What is going on? Are we cursed? No, I'm asking. Is this kingdom cursed? Why would our kings be dying? Eh? Listen. It is obvious you are not telling us the truth. Exactly. No single truth is coming from you. It means you don't even have eye. Mm. Nor ear to hear from the gods of our land. We are in the dark, mm -hmm. and no one can lead us out from the darkness into light. But we said we have you. We have you. Mm -hmm. Listen, listen. You are incompetent. Completely. Yes, we lost confidence in you. We lost it. Mm -hmm. Three men, three illustrious men of this kingdom died within a short space of three. Three months, and we have a seer like you, a chief priest. This is an abomination, and it's even too hard for my mouth to speak. But I shall consult with the gods about this mystery. For obviously, there is something wrong somewhere. Yes. But this mystery is mysterious. Hey! On the way, both. As a mom, it's okay. Hey. We are done with that consultation. <coughs> and none of that consultation is not needed. As the Ujofor of this kingdom, with my authority, I dismiss you from this kingdom. Bam! We no longer need your services because you are incompetent. Compliment. Listen, I give you 24 hours. 24 hours for you to leave this kingdom. Live here with everything you have, including your family members. But at the expiration of these 24 hours, we still find you around. <laughs> we shall stone you to death. Wow. Oh, you. Leave us. Leave. Ah, Leave. 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 Please, please, please. Know that the ghost has left me for so many years now. I am now very empty. I can't even see or know what is going on in the palace. Look at what I have brought upon myself. King Jamike. Ah. Oh. Where am I going to go from here? What am I going to do with my children? Now I have been banished from this kingdom. Ah! Hi! Ojofo? Mm -hmm. This is very scary and unbelievable. I do not know what to say again. I was in Yamazia drawn. Look at it. Mazudo has refused to be consoled. What are we going to do right now? If I am 
iche ibegwe mm asini pa mara ke ge si me na ke se me ade ezuku media majugo nwa awo ono that is true we are dumbfounded we don't even know the action to take anymore but abide by my word mm -hmm. and it shall be well with us. Okay. Take my advice. Let us forget everything happening in the palace for now. Mm -hmm. To avoid the distraction. Let's avoid it. Okay. I am suggesting mm -hmm. that we take a step. Mm -hmm. Let us know what is happening to us mm -hmm. and know the source. Mm -hmm. And when it is done, mm -hmm. the solution must come. Therefore, I am suggesting. I'm all here to let us travel out mm -hmm. to a far land. Even if it means going to Abagana. Mm -hmm. You know Abagana land? Yes, I do. Let us go there. Mm -hmm. We shall find a fresh chief priest mm -hmm. or priestess mm -hmm. who will help us out. Mm -hmm. Yes. Ojopo, you've spoken very well. But no one will ever imagine or encourage his son to go to that palace. That is the truth. And what are we going to do now? Chebekwe. Mm -hmm. You heard me clearly. I do. We have to travel to mm -hmm. land. Mm -hmm. There we shall find a flawless chief priest mm -hmm. who will not be like Dikamba, our past chief priest, mm -hmm. who was deceiving us, mm -hmm. telling us lies, misleading us. And when this flawless chief priest comes, mm. he will reveal the source of our problem. And when the source of our problem is revealed, mm. the solution is there. I agree with you. You are correct. You are correct. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> you be correct. Yeah? You are on point. So you're seeing your mother give birth to you and died? Yes. He died after giving birth to me in the hospital. I'm so sorry about that. So tell me, what about your father? Because I understand that this is your maternal home. And I know that you grew up all alone in this kingdom. Where's your father? I don't know my father. I'm a product of rape. What? You mean your mother was raped? According to my grandmother, my my mother got raped while coming back from the farm. This is really sad. I'm, I'm so sorry. Okay? It's okay. It's in the past now. So I'm working so hard to make sure that I become someone in life. That is what I owe myself. Are you stalking me? So because of this boy, because of this overripe mango standing in front of me, huh? Excuse you. Uh, please just calm down, okay? I'll take care of the situation. Just calm. Chidi, what are you doing here? Are you stalking me now? Huh? Look, I already told you that we cannot be together. You are not fit to be with me. It's over. This relationship is over. So why can't you get that into your head? Why? Because of this thinking, Akarasela. Eh? I will not stand here and watch you insult me in my house. Just, just calm down, okay? I've got this. Just calm down. Get out. And if I insult you, what will happen? Listen, I've marked your face. I will deal with you. I will reduce you to nothing. I've marked your face. Watch it. You can do nothing. You can't do anything. You will do nothing, rapist.
Pardon? Mm -hmm. You heard me. You heard me well! You rapist. That's what you are. I had you. You will hear from me soon. Sorry. Princess, you, you called him a rapist. You know what? Just ignore him. He's a toothless barking dog. He's a nobody. Sorry for the interruption. So let's continue. So I should speak to my father and he will employ you in his company. Are you serious? Yes, I am. Oh my God, my princess, thank you. Thank you, God bless you. You're welcome. God bless you, thank you. You are welcome. And you have to stop going to the bush to hunt meat, and you have to stop frying Akara. Okay? Okay, I'll, I'll stop. I'll, I'll try. I'll stop. That's good. Oh my God, my princess, God bless you. Thank you so much. You're welcome. I like you. You're meek and humble. I love your personality. I mean, not every guy your age will be so humble as to fry a cara with their wives, not to talk of their grandma. I am so intrigued by your humility. I am. Thank you so much. So, keep it up. Thank you so much. This is my nature. Thank you. God bless you. Yeah, come see me after the car. Sure. I had a good time. <laughs> From princess, my woman, tell him to stay clear. There's one man that came to your mother's shop and scattered every of our goods. My mother's shop? Yes. I didn't even know what your mother did to you. When? Just now. Now, 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 now. Now. Yeah, let's go. Who is that person? Eh? Let's go. You need to see the man. Who have what that you cost to your mother? Don't worry. Don't, 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 don't say anything. Let, let, let's go. Let me know if he's if, 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 if mad. The man must be mad. Are you just going to look like that? What would you have me do? Yeah? <laughs> See, if he came is what will make her happy, let her have him. Neka, I thought you said you will fight for your love. Why are you withdrawing back? Eh? Fight for my love? What are you saying? 
Does Papa Mwa look like Romeo and Juliet to you? Eh? Ulochi, I'm looking you with one eye. Let me ask you a question. Since you were born till this age, have you ever in your life heard or seen the poor fighting the rich? Not just the rich, the one with power. The one you say, Uli Pochia, Uli Pochia. Have you? No, you have not. But you want me to go and fight the princess. You are a devil incarnate. And I bind you. You devil. Get behind me. I don't want to be involved. At all. Later. Love is not for the faint-hearted people. I thought you would fight your way through. My pass. If it's Chiamaka now, you start throwing blows. Why not go and confront the princess instead? As my pass. Maria. Madam. My name is not Saint Valentine. I am Nek. A.K.A. Popomwa. I will not die for love. Look at her legs. No fighter. No. Go and fight the princess. Nonsense. He came here He came. What is going on between you and Princess Adogo? Eh? It was rumored that you are the cause of the broken relationship she had with the with the man that wanted Mama, to marry her. I am not the cause of anything. Princess Adugo is just my friend. I don't know what transpired between she and, and that madman. Tell me how a normal human being would go to, 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 to scatter the things in your shop. Eh? Are, are you the cause of his problems? Why would you go to, 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 to your shop to, to, to scatter things? He's just lucky that I wasn't around though. If not, we'll join, we'll join the madness together. I want to scatter your goods. An old woman that did nothing to, 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 to him. Am, am, am I the, 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 the cause of their relationship that, 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 that made... I'm, I'm very angry. I'm very, very angry. I'm very, very angry. He came here for now. Angry or not angry. Angry or not angry. Listen to me. Distance yourself from Princess Adugo. Ask one of my go. Stay away from her. Mama, that, that... See, I don't want what happened today to become an issue between you and that boy. Because I don't want it to turn into something else. Mama, what you're asking me to do may not be possible, though. Because Princess Adugo promised to get me a job in her father's company. You know, since I finished school, I've not been doing anything. And I'm tired. I need to work now. That's why I went to school. I need to work. And now someone is promising to give me a job. You're telling me to stay away from, from, from her because of, because of that madman. Mm. Hey. I know why I'm saying this, so oh. Our people used to say that someone that is hated does not squat on the roadside. Eh? He got a puebanya of orana for a jail. Ubo wegi. No. Biko, Biko, stay away from Princess Adugo. It is better for you to continue to manage this Akara business with me. Biko, than me hearing useless stories about you. I will not take it though. I will not take it that you are fighting over, over a, a princess Adugo with any man. Mama, I'm not fighting with anybody. I'm just, she's just my friend. I'm not fighting with anybody. Okay. Managing Nakara business, for how long will I keep managing it? Huh? Yeah. Amaka. Mm hmm? Take it easy on me, please. Amaka. I want us to come back. I've missed a lot of us. I mean, our relationship. Our bond. Our love. Please, Amaka. <laughs> I, I swear from the depth of my soul, the blood that flows in my veins, 
I can do anything. I mean, anything possible to bring us back as we used to be. Please. <laughs> oh, pardon my man, as you're so funny. <laughs> Hold on, let me laugh a little. <laughs> Is this a story or a tells by moonlight? Oh, this reality. Huh? A reality. First of all, let me ask you. Who are the us? <laughs> Something is wrong with me. Something is wrong with your head to say we are us. I'm fine. I'm fine. There is no us anymore. Take that in. Okay? Come on, Amaka. Stop sounding this way. Um, well, haven't I apologized enough? Haven't I begged you? Come on. My friend, if I... Are well, you mad? If you touch me again. Okay, fine. See, you can see it in my face. Before man and God. Please. I still love you. Yay. Yes. I still so much miss you. Wow. Please, can't you see I'm tired fighting? Please. <laughs> <laughs> no sense in, I'm tired fighting on the streets. Oh, but those calm down. Be calming down. First of all, let me just tell you. Let's, let me make this straight to you, okay? Fine. I am in a relationship. Not just a relationship. A very serious relationship. So get that to your head, okay? Stop disturbing me, please. Be co obodo. Oh, please, oh! Amaka. Hmm. Dude likes water. Oh. But not when the water is hot. Okay. I will just kill that person. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Come to see facts. <sighs> Who is that person trying to take away my sweet? Asa for me. Me, Obodu. Me, Ri Obodu. I'm Boom Olodu. Gatiaka. Ayaya. Yes. Okay. Fine. Let me tell you. My sweets. Potato. Mm. My tomato juice. <laughs> Calm down, man. My baby. Is it because of just a little curry? Papa. Okay, remember now, you say you need some time, and I've given you enough time. What's up? Something about. Ah. Understand now. Eh, uh hey! -huh. Let me make this very simple because this sun is too hot and intense. I, Chiyamaka, I'm in a very serious relationship with Ikem. Mm. Who? Ikem Mefuna, you've heard me. Ikem? So, yes, yeah, so, oh! That's. Say, Papari boy, he is my boyfriend. So please, I use God's he name. He came from that yes. Abino. Mm. He came. I like him. The Abino. Name. Yes, that Abino is what I've chosen. Is who I've chosen. So don't interfere. Oh, but don't leave me alone. You said he came, eh? He came. The Abino. Yeah, yeah. The Abino. Yeah. He can't service you like me, me Obodo. I can never forgive that. That Abino. In this community, in this Obodo, in this village, I say came, he came, and your mother, you people must hear what. Unuga I must see. In fact, I must give you people heat, heat in this village, in this community. I will make you believe that. Mwa Obodo, Uga Tagi, Nye Gisi, Iga Hatisi, he came, he came efuna. You want to chop my, 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 my jalof. My mama? Who was that? He died though. Just like that. He started talking to anybody. What? Just like that? Yes. I warned him. I cautioned him. I told him the history about his kingdom. But he was desperate. He wanted to become the king of his kingdom. He never listened to me. Now look at it. Huh? He said, had I known, he said, brother to Mr. Too Late. If I had known, Joe would have not listened to men in council at all. Now oh. I've lost my only son. Abba Zimaka is gone. It's terrible. I, I understand how you feel. 
See, no wonder I called his number severally, but it wasn't connecting. It was permanently switched off, though. Mm. I, I even came to the palace and everywhere was locked. Hi, Ndo. May he so rest in peace. Huh? I was the person that convinced you to accept this kingship. Now look at me, Abbas Maka. I am alone in this world. It's okay. It's okay. Mm. Uh, um, let me reverse and um, take you to no, your... No, no, don't bother. I'm, I'm still going very close here. Uh, I'm almost close to where I'm going, yes. Okay. All right, I, I should be on my way there. Yes, please. All right. Send me word to your people, eh? It's okay, I will. It's okay. All right, thank you. Okay, Chidi, one more. I am trying so hard to be civil and polite with all your tantrums. And I hope you've not forgotten that my father, Igwe Obasi, retired as a Nigerian army general before he became king of this kingdom. I hope you've not forgotten. Princess Adugo, tell me the truth. Nothing but the truth. Who is that boy? <laughs> Who is he to you? My newfound love. My good friend. And I am so in love with him. Madly in love with him. So Chidi, you had quit trying. Quit trying. Because it will never work. You're beautiful, by the way. Beautiful lips. All right, then. So you are the one who have decided to die, Ikemefuna. What do you mean by that? My friend Obodo is complaining bitterly. In fact, he's very, very angry with you. Why? Why? You already know why. He said you are dating his girl, Chiamaka. Yes. Chiamaka confided in him that both of you are lovers. Me. That she's no longer interested in Obodo. Now, Obodo is mad at you. Where is that one coming from? Who, who in this village said I'm having anything to do with Chama? Chamaka said so. Chamaka said so. Me. <laughs> Me and Chamaka lovers. How? I don't know what you're talking about. So I don't even know Chamaka. Talk more of being lovers with anybody. He came. You better go and clear your name from your Obodo. Clear which name? Go and tell the Obodo that I sent you that I don't know anything concerning Chamaka. You're sending me. You're sending me to Obodo. Listen, let me tell you. You better go and clear your name. Else, anywhere Obodo sees you. Did, did you, you hear what I just said? Rot, oh. Did you hear what I just said? You are going said. to face his rot. I know why I'm telling you. I don't have anything with Chiamaka now. I'm telling you, you're still saying you face his rot. Yeah. Please, oh. Don't join me in stupid talks. You Who came. Don't say I didn't warn you. Don't say I didn't warn you. Obodo will destroy you. I need seven days to commune with the spirits. I see blood. I see the spirits of the dead hovering around this palace. Of all the kings that died, only one is a true royal blood. The dread 
face that just make up. Yeah. Give me seven days. I will provide the answers you seek. I of the gods. Is seven days not too long? This kingdom needs a king. And we have our festival is just at hand. Please. There are protocols to these things. Else! There will be consequences. Give me seven days. Seven days. Seven days. Well, I uh, we have no options. We have to be patient for seven days. Exactly. Mm. Mama, 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 I'm not here to play. See, I am not here to play. In fact, I'm not here to open my teeth. I'm not out to talk anything out of point. Where is your son? Where is your son? What is your problem? Eh? The teacher is sick of Ochie Udene. Batana Ben. Why are you making noise here? What did he came after my grandson do to you? Eh? Everyone in this village knows that he came after does not find anyone's trouble. Why are you making noise? What is the matter? Eh? I'm making noise. Man, 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 man. I will teach your son. Because I'm teaching you a lesson. Don't worry. No, no, look at you. Come. 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 Are you mad? Eh? What? How dare you talk to my mother like that? So, you are the person. The one I mean, the Abino going after my babe, right? Hey! Why did you destroy the old woman's goods? I mean, why would you do such a thing? I, I did what I did out of anger, Your Majesty. You did what you did out of anger? So you condescended so low as to destroy the goods of an old woman? Out of anger? Kid, why would you destroy an old woman's goods in this kingdom? Why? Ask him. So that is how you are going to destroy my daughter's properties. When the spirit of anger enters into your little self, in the event that you get married to my daughter, that is the way you're going to be, right? Now you listen. For your information, my daughter has been begging me to grant her wish to let you go. I've been resisting because of the love I had for you. But now that you have manifested your animalistic tendencies, you are no longer fit to be my son-in-law. Your Majesty, Your Majesty, Your Majesty, I, I am sorry. Please forgive me. I, I am sorry. Please, please, Your Majesty, forgive me. You are sorry. You should be apologizing to that old woman and not to me. Now, get out of my sight. Leave my palace this minute. Yeah, you're Chede. Chede. You may leave.
sorry for this. Find your man, eh? Ukimefuna has come this beautiful relationship. Eh? Yeah? I'm not saying anything. What do you want to say? Eh? What should I say? The princess has snatched the crush. I'm supposed to go there. and fight him and win at the same time. What? Just take a look at you. Fighting your fellow man simply because of a woman who doesn't care about you anymore. <laughs> Jamaica doesn't give a damn about you. Can't you understand that? I can never understand that. I must get Jamaica back by fire, by force. Now, for your own information, Bodo, he came, is in love with Princess Adugo, not your Jamaica. Jamaica is behind all this your raving right now. All this your anger. And she I made it up for you to be angry. And, and I, I don't care. care. I don't care. You don't care. Yes. Oh moi, Bobodo. Me Robodo. I am not Olodo. Obodo, you will care. I, I should care. I don't care. You don't care. I don't care. And listen, let me inform you. For that stick, he hit my leg. Look at. Look at. Look at. Mwa. I will show him Pepe. I will tell him I'm Obodo. Ne Robodo. I no Lodo. I will give Ikem a big hit, a big shit in this community. He's a bastard to the core. Now, Lester, let me tell you what you don't know. From a reliable source, mm. I will make to understand that Ikem is in love with Princess Adugo. Not even your Shamaka, and you're killing them for nothing. He deserves an apology. Da! I apologize to him. Da! A B, a B, and C for me. Obodo, ne ri Obodo. Abu Malodo, okay? I can never apologize to that Abino. I can never apologize to that bastard. He came. Okay. Instead of me to apologize to he came, I better chop shit. I eat shit. Okay. That is it. Listen. I will show that Abinu the stuff I'm made of. Uh, I'm a bodo. No real bodo. Okay. For that Abinu to do this to me. Keep ranting. I will kill him. I will pour him acid. You can acquire that. What? My bodo. Okay. Ma Bobodo, ne rio Bodo. Okay. Obodo. Obodo. Listen, let me tell you. The Igbaga Sanya this time. A man can never be a bastard in his comfort zone. A man can never be a bastard in his comfort zone. He's a bastard plus bastard. I swear to this son. Eh. Hey, I will apologize. make sure I kill him. Better go and apologize to him. Ah! Better go and do me. it. Me. Apologize to him. <laughs> Better go and apologize. For me to apologize. I will chop shit. Nga. This is. Ah. You are lucky they don't break the big head. You are very, very lucky they don't break your head. What is it? Eh? You're crying, I saw you. Neka. Ha! Open of all people is crying. Kulochi, what is it? Why is it so difficult for you to mind your business? What is it? Just leave me alone. Eh. Okay. Sorry, yo. I am sure you will carry this your busybody and mouth and come to me. Get out. I should. I should get out. Can you calm yourself down? I don't have anything to do with her, Maka. That, that boy is just blabbing. I don't have anything to do with her. And you know it. Don't mind that fool. He's just talking rubbish. 
he picked a fight with you and you are telling me that he's talking rubbish. Mama, I'm telling you the truth now. Is it that you don't believe me? Have I ever lied to you? Amaka has been the one disturbing me for us to have a relationship. And I told her it would never be possible. Who's oh, so name? And as much as we've been, we've been friends back in secondary school, but we've grown past that now. I told her that. So I don't know where all, all these ones are coming from. Hey! The children of this day. Hey! So she's the one broadcasting it in this village that you are her lover. That's what it means now. Who else? Because I don't know where they, her lover I don't know where they got that from. I have nothing to do with her maka. Mm -hmm. Mom, you have to be very careful. You see that dream you told me? It is still ringing in my head. Biko, I am somehow afraid. Biko, be very careful. You know? That boy is just lucky. But I know wherever he is now, his body, his body will definitely tell him. Ibukaya. No. Don't worry. Mana Biko, be very careful. I don't know what is wrong with all this. How's business? How's it going? Well, thank God. <laughs> and your mom? She's fine. Okay. Doing very well. Yes. Thank you. You refuse to take anything? No. No, I'm, I'm fine. I just ate something before coming. Hi, baby. Bye, princess. How are you? Hi. Young man. How are you? I'm fine, sir. Good. So, father, that's the man I told you about. He graduated from the university two years ago. He studied business management and I thought it was wise for him to come to the palace to see you. He doesn't have a job. Young man, you're welcome. Thank you. Ooh, well, um, I think he's a fine young man. <laughs> I'm liking him already. Really? Yes. <laughs> well, it's all right. You're welcome to my palace. And uh, as for the job, of course, you know, anything for my angel. Yes, so you can give him the job if you so desire. Oh, God. Thank you, sir. Father, it's okay. Thank you. <laughs> oh, my it's all I don't know how to thank you. <laughs> thank you so much for the opportunity. I'm, I'm very grateful. Thank you. It's okay. You've thanked me enough. It's all right. Like, it's still shocking to me. I never knew His Majesty will accept me just like that. Eh? Regarding the, the, the place I come from, the kind of job I do, he just accepted me like that. A lot of people do not even know I'm a graduate. I see. Maybe because you... Help your grandma. Yeah, so. Because they see me, <laughs> they don't even know I, I went but to school. You don't have to blame them, okay? Thank you. Ikem, you resume work on Monday. Next tomorrow. Oh my God. Thank you very it's much. Okay, you're Thank welcome. Thank you. God bless you. Thank you. Amen. Bless you too. God. So, let me drop you off. This is so I can go. Okay.
princess. No. <laughs> you are welcome. Oh. Thank you. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. <laughs> yes, ma. Um, so it okay, came. I'll see you on Monday. Bye bye, Oma. Just got a job. What? <laughs> what job? The king gave me a job in his company. I don't know. He just he just saw me and and, and, and and said he likes me and just gave me a job just like that, Mama. Yeah, you are lying. You are lying. Mama, I'm telling you the truth. I'm starting on Monday. Monday. This Monday, Monday Mama. This Monday. Wait, wait. You are starting a job hmm? at Igwe's company. This Monday. This Monday, Mama. Just like that. Just like that. The job I've been hey. searching for how long? Just like that, oh. Hey! Ozum man name no kwa. Chekwe, it's not one day can one nature. Can one nature, mama. Can one nature. Let me just go inside and wash my white. Because just such a thing. Go and wash it very well. Go and wash it very well. <laughs> no, no. Mama, I can see that the princess is in love with you. <laughs> Mama, what was the meaning of that? Yes, I can see it in her eyes. You're not seeing anything. No, 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 it's all over her. <laughs> what I'm saying is all over her. Let me tell you lion begets lion. Yes, the fragrance is always the same, whether rich or poor. Oh, you think because I'm now an old woman, I cannot understand the handwriting on the wall. No, no, I don't understand because now why are? Let me tell you, it is always the same, and it is a mystery our people hardly understand. Lion begets. Mama, because there is nothing begetting anything. The princess and I are just friends, and and that's it. <laughs> nothing like. <laughs> Kikemefne, you are a lion. Yes, believe me, you are a lion. Yes, the look remains king of the jungle. No, I don't be making you know? a blood. Yes, so lions always recognize their kinds wherever they are. Oh, I'm making my head swell. Why yes, no problem. <laughs> but one thing I know for sure. Something striking is about to happen between you and the princess. Mama Rapum, not no striking anything that is going to happen. We are just friends. Friends. That that's I see. I'm waiting. My mother those days, when she was alive, she, she used to say, Anya can Anya can My angel, what is disturbing you? Father, I had a bad dream. A bad dream? What about? A belt in Kim. Chidi tried to shoot in Kim right at this palace. Shoot in Kim? Why? Maybe because he felt that we are in love. Or maybe he thought he's the reason I broke up with him. Father, do you know that Chidi had, had tried to sleep with me more than once? What? Even after knowing the implication, yet he still wanted to have his way with me. Father, that is why I have decided to stay far away from him. And to make things more creepy, his friend, his late friend, once told me that Chidi is a rapist. Rapist? Yes. But I don't know. Perhaps he was just saying that to 
buy himself through. That is a huge accusation from a bosom friend. Dad, you know what they say. Your best friend knows your top secret. Hmm. I don't know, it might be a coincidence, but um, I also had a dream. And it wasn't a good one about the camp. Father. Yes. I. I think I'm in love with him, Kim. I know. <laughs> Surprise. You are my daughter, and um, I know when you are in love. When you are in love with someone, you always like to make the person happy and uh, prosperous. But not to worry. I'm with you on this one. You are? Uh -huh. <laughs> Thank you, Emily. <laughs> you are the best father in the world, and I love you so much. And you are the best daughter in the whole wide world. <laughs> I love you more, baby. Thank you. <laughs> I think it's better for us to go and pay her visit. Just a visit. And then we're going there to discover. Because she's in her kind already. It will be easy for us. Eh? Maybe when she sees us, she will know that we are desperate. Oh, beware. Mm -hmm. Beware. Yes. Most times you don't reason like me. Why? You're asking me why. Mm -hmm. Then why are you thinking of paying her a visit? She gave us seven days. Didn't you hear her well? I did. And out of the seven days, four days have elapsed. And they are talking of visiting her. Has her time finished? She gave us a time limit. And until that time finishes, you have no right to visit her. Do you know that our visiting can cause a distress in whatever she could? Don't you know that? This is a spiritual It's not what you see with your naked eyes. We have to allow her. Until her time elapses, she will be the one to look for us. Are you talking about <laughs> okay. You are point, eh? No problem. Just concern about you. I beg, you don't tell me about this I concern. Are you concerned more than every other person? Everybody here in this kingdom is concerned that we must obey the voice of the gods. Okay. Yeah. You say so. I'm following you. You shouldn't quarrel over this now. Eh? You didn't do anything. You didn't do anything. You will confess when the time comes. You will confess when the time comes. Oh, yeah, move. Fast. <laughs> you are still talking. You are innocent. Okay. Okay, when the time comes, he can dance. When the time comes, he can dance. What did he do? What is his crime? Young man, what did you do? I didn't do anything. You are just accusing me wrongly. I'm innocent. I'm innocent. Which kind of dream is this? Why were they beating him? What crime did he commit? Oh, this is not good. Not good at all. Whew. What sign is this dream trying to show me? Oh, 
Who is this young man? How come I liked him? Seeing him for the first time. There is something unique about that young man. But I can't place my hands on it. Ah. Daddy. My angel. <laughs> You're back. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. How are you? I'm fine. I see you're relaxing. Yeah, of course I am. Uh, Dad? Yes, my angel. You look worried. What's the matter? Ah, uh, not really. I was just pondering about that young man. Who? He came here for now, of course. Okay. Yes, there is something about him. I mean, there is this aura of royalty around him. He possesses this personality of a king. Hmm. Yes. Well, Father, I think all men are kings in their own way. Hmm. You're right. Well, never mind. <laughs> Welcome back. Ah, oh, thank you, Daddy. You need to go inside and rest. Okay. I had a long day. Rest well. All right, Dad. And you too. Let me take some fresh air. All right, Dad. Where are you going with that traffic? Hey, come here, please. Come here, keep going. I to talk. My son is passageway for for grass cutters, so I want to set trap for them to know if I'll catch anyone before night falls. Traps are being set at night, and do you know that? Well, well, these animals also walk around at daytime. I just want to. Sets it quickly. You can please change your mentality. You have to reframe. You have gotten a white collar job, which you are about to start tomorrow. Why can't you allow the animals in the bush to rest? Keep this trap. Mama, if I catch this meat now, you'll still be the first to tell me I want the laps. I want this one, I want that. Let me just quickly set it. At least I'm starting work tomorrow. Let me do it for the last time today. I'm already here there now. I'm not eating anymore. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not. There's a big definite. You have to, there's no water in the house. I will when I come back, Mama. Hey! 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 Coming to my house this early morning. Good morning. Morning. Yeah. How are you? I'm fine. Hey. Ah, so, no. Mama. How is His Majesty and the Palace? Oh, everyone is fine, and the palace is fine. You're yeah, welcome. Thank you. Um, is Ikem around? Oh. I've been trying to reach him, and he's not taking my calls. Hey, um, um, sorry. Oh, um, he left his phone in the room. Yes, he went to set his trap. He will soon be back. His trap? Yes. Didn't he tell you that he's hunting? He used oh. to hunt uh, bush meats. Oh, I see. Oh, yes. 
Yes, Mama, he told me. He told me. Is he good? Uh, it's fine. Please, when he gets back, tell him to come to the palace that my father wants to talk to him. It's very important. Uh, my princess, is anything the problem? No, no problem. No problem. Uh, because at all. has your father changed his mind over the job? No, 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 Mama. It's not about the job. My father just wants to talk to him. Hmm? Uh -huh. So let him come to the palace when he gets back. It's okay, no. Ninety-nine days for a thief and one day for the people. Oh, but, oh, he what? came here. He's a rapist. Oh. He him. Raping Chiamaka. Rape? Yes. I did not do it. Shut him. Shut him up. Shut him up. Shut him up. I'm in Why are you doing this? Why are you doing this? Chiamaka! What are you saying? I'm in I'm in I don't do it. Hey, shut up! How dare you? How dare you? You left the daughter of Ono. I did not do it! Yes! I did not do it! I did not do it! You! Let me, 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 let so I could make meal for my father before coming to the palace to, to work. As I was trying to fetch the firewood, someone grabbed me behind. Then I was trying to scream for, for help. He hit me with a strap, threw me to the floor and raped me. Ah! Wait, 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 w
Okay. Quiet, quiet, everyone. God. Take him to the palace cell. Who is that? Onye? I know what is it. Oh, give me. There's a problem. Which trouble? He came. He came as be arrested. Which, wait, so which he came? My own he came. He came here for now. He has been taken to the palace cell. As we speak now. What did he do? He raped Ono's daughter in the bush. Oh, so man, then. Who raped who? He came. Wait, so he came and came. Yeah. Did what? He raped Ono's daughter. Yeah, 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 yeah. Stop the rape. Or some rape. Because one answer, you have to go to another which he came, he came, came out, cannot be true. Did you touch him? I didn't do it. How can I do such a thing? I didn't do it. They are lying against me. I didn't do it. I don't such a my guy. Lying down and blood all over her body. I want to know why. Only for money to come out and start calling me a rapist. I didn't do it. I didn't do it. It is not the same blood bug. I don't know. I don't know. It's okay. I believe you. I know you did not do it. I believe you. Nothing will happen to you. Okay? Nothing will happen to you. I will make sure of that. Your head will not go for it, okay? Mm -hmm. You have to be strong. You have to trust me. Nothing will happen to you. Please. Can I at least see my grandma? Please. Yeah. She's in the palace. Okay? I'll call her for you. You have to be strong. My presence, your time is up. You have to be strong, okay? I will try, but I need to see my grandma. Please. Please. I'll call her for you. I'll also get you some things. My you. presence, your time is up, please. I have to go now, don't worry. I'll be back, okay? You have to be strong. He can never do such a thing in his life. He can never. No in this life. He can never do such a thing in his life. He can never. Not in this life. Not even in the world to come. He can never. I can never do this. Woman, keep quiet and stop disturbing us. He came from the raped my daughter, and he must die according to the law. Yes. Hey. Go to the cell and bid him farewell because you may not see him again. Bado, if we because say something, please, I'm begging you. Because say something, what about what I become? The only thing that is remaining for me, listen to the cry of a poor widow, because I'm begging you. That is my grandson, or the only thing remaining for me. He's innocent. He's innocent. This is just a frame up. I did not bring him came for a such mother because I'm begging you. He came for the ask fear for women. He has so much respect for women. He came here for that one cannot do this. My grandson is innocent because he will say something, do something because he came here for the respect for women. Yes. And yet he raped my daughter. Oh. He will. My daughter was raped. Even the palace doctor 
confirmed that. So why are we wasting time with this woman? After all, you cheer Ibuka's son died for the same offense. Why are we wasting time here? Uh, woman, listen to me. We have a law. Yes. We have a law in this kingdom against rape. Therefore, justice must prevail. But one thing I must guarantee you is that we will do proper investigation. We will carry out due diligence and ensure that we come up with good verdict. A just one. So, go home. Investigate, you know. Madam, go, go, go. A death sentence. Oh, Father, look at He came as innocent. He's innocent. He didn't do it. He didn't do it. Look, my angel, power belongs to the people. Eh? We, we, we have a law, a decree. No, 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 no. Don't tell me that. Don't. Don't. That you can't do this to me. You can't. Fine. The people want him dead. But you're king. You have the power to set him free. He died. You have the power to do this. Please. Please. No. Sweetheart. If, if I do that, they will come against me. <laughs> Look. This is a very delicate issue. <laughs> we have to tread carefully. Please. Dad, no innocent life should be killed under your leadership. Though. No innocent life should. <laughs> My father will be back very soon. Very soon. You know, I've missed his friend. Yes, I know, I know, but... Um... What's wrong with her? She said she's okay. She's fine. She's fine. Good, 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 good. <laughs> okay, so.
Late King Jamike has a son. Okay. A son? Yes. A son. All the attempts to flush him became abortive. He collided with the chief priest to flush him. But he is a royal blood. Eyes of the gods. We have been standing here for the past five minutes and you have not said a word. Why did you call me out? Wait. Wait. Great. Very well, I will wait. I will wait. Wait. All right, fine. I will wait. I am waiting. Greetings. She's carrying your seed. Wise one. Yes, I did. Where did you get that information from? I see in the dark. I also see in spirit, and I see the physical. Why do you want to terminate your blood that she's carrying? Why is one I am truly sorry about that? Uh, you see, I, I just want to get rid of that which she carries. Please, I need you to help me. Why don't you marry her since you have put her in the family way? Why do you want to destroy the fetus in her womb? No! I don't know. I cannot possibly marry her. Why is one? I am already betrothed to Ezine, and you know that. I cannot betray my father and marry her. She is just a maiden, a mere maiden. Wise one. You have been my friend for a very long time. I need you to help me get rid of that child that she carry. Mm. For I have tried so much to get rid of it, but it does not work. If you help me, I promise you, I will take care of your sons from primary to university education. I will sponsor. Mm. Only if you help me, wise one. Are you sure of what you're saying, my prince? I am Prince Jamike, the heir apparent of the great throne of this great kingdom. I am your next king. I have the power to do and undo. My word is my bond. I'll get back to my shrine, my prince. I'll bring you something. And once I give you that thing, you give it to her. Let her take it. As soon as she takes it, 
that baby will be gone. But there are consequences. She might likely die. That is the least of my problem. It is none of my concern. All I want is for that child to be eliminated. Gone forever. So make sure when you give her the concussion, you send her far, far away from the palace. So that she doesn't die in the palace. Wise one. You sound as if the next king of this great kingdom is stupid. I am not stupid. I will send her out. Okay? Quick. Go to your shrine and get me the concussion. Now, don't forget also that there will be consequences. Damn! The consequences, wise one. This is why I have you. Now go. <laughs> Adure. My friend. Sit. My prince, this is the royal blood. Why do you want me to flush your own child? Why? Take. You know why I want you to drink it. Take it. So that my mind can be at peace. My prince, just let me leave the palace. I promise I won't come back. Please, let me just leave the palace with the pregnancy. And the child will grow up and come back one day to reign havoc in my palace. Do not argue with me. No, my prince. No, please. I command you! Drink it! Now! Drink it! Adore, drink it! Royal blood cannot be flushed. I saw everything. Mm. Mm. He is the one that will sit on the throne, that will pacify the spirit. Men we continue to die. Wise one, I beg to uh, crave the, to crave your indulgence. Please, who is this son of Jamike, our late king? We are talking about. How do we locate him? The Allah Kingdom. Yes, the Allah Kingdom. Ask of Kemefuna, the grandson of Nedi, the popular Akrasela in that kingdom. That is where your king is. Yes. A soul is weeping. Filled with bitterness. The cloud is gloomy. With chipping sounds on the bed. I see death. Death after death. Sorrow begins. And sorrow refuses to end. I see a woman. Crying for her lovely son. Who will console her 
and make it not to happen. Go! Go and look for your king. For this needs to be taken care of. If not, all the kings will die one by one. His Majesty is likely going to change the law or free Kemefuna. You may ask me why. Why? Why? Good. Because Princess Sadugo is in love with Kemefuna. Ah, say, oh, no, 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 impossible. no, 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 it can never be done. Relax. There is tendency that it will happen because his majesty can do that just to please his daughter. But as the youth of this kingdom, enough is enough. It will never, it never happen. happen. Ekene was killed for this singular act. Yes. Mm -hmm. Therefore, Ikeme Funa must equally be killed for this singular act. We will defend it with the last drop of our blood. Ikeme Funa can never go scot free. <laughs> never. Hey, voila, voila, voila. No bodonka. For this village. For this kingdom. You see? He came. Must be put to death. Yes. He must be put to death. I don't care about His Majesty or the daughter. I'm not seeing them. I'm not seeing them at all. Uh, that's good. You see, I, I, I like the spirit. You see? This is what we're going to do now. Hmm? Okay. I'll be giving you guys money. Handsomely. I'll pay you guys handsomely. Every day. So, night and morning, we will surround and mount guards around the palace and the palace gate. Because I'm having this feeling that His Majesty may want to sneak Ike Mefuna out of the palace in order for him to escape execution. <laughs> so we have to monitor him until the day of execution. Life. <laughs> You're right. In fact, you are very right. You know what? From this time on, hmm? we will hand over the case to you. Hmm? In fact, you will rule us. We want to work with you. Hmm. Use us. Use us anyhow you want to use us. Eh? Really does. In fact, leader. from now, eh? just rule us. Good. Eh? We'll work with you. Yes. Nice one. You see, I will give you guys a little something. Just go about drink. Buy some sticks as much as you want to buy. Enjoy yourselves. Go home and um, prepare yourself. Okay? You are the real man. Guys. Guys, guys, guys. Fine. <laughs> wow. All right, so enjoy yourself, okay? God suffer our land. You are the gods that sees both in the physical and in the spirit. You alone knows that my grandson is innocent. He is innocent of the accusation. Please save him for me. To your Please talk to me. Who is responsible for this pregnancy? Mama, please. I don't want to talk about it. I beg of you. This is the same thing you have been saying since you came back to this house with this pregnancy. Why are you so secretive to your mother? Why are you out of me? Why are you hiding the source of this pregnancy? It is almost time for your delivery. Are you going to hide it forever? I don't understand. And I know you worked uh, 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 in uh, Umwoni Kingdom when you were staying with my late sister. But what I don't know is why you suddenly left uh, uh, the palace at, at where? Mama, and Mama, I just told you that I was raped by a unknown person. 
I don't even want to record the event. It's so terrible. I know you are lying. You keep saying it and I keep telling you that I don't believe you. Mama, please, help me work because go. Ma, I was raped. Yeah, I'm not sure. 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 Yeah, I'm not
Okay, Obia. Mama Obia. Are you feeling pain? Mama. Chile. Ah! Chile again. Obia. Mama. 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 Sorry, 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 sorry. Mama, I need to go home. No, 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 not home. Hospital. Mama, I need to go home. Hospital, get up. Get up. Ah! Mama. Get up. Sorry. My daughter is coming out. Hey! It's Mama. Why? Why, Wam? Why? You left this world, leaving me with your beautiful baby boy. Hey, why did you leave me? Why did you leave your child with me? Why? Why? Hey. The doctor said you took a lot of pills to flush out this baby, which affected your health badly. Why did you even take off it? Why? Why? You forgot that children are blessed from God. You forgot that children are blessings to mankind. I... <sighs> I have forgiven you. I have forgiven you. I will take care of my grandson. I promise you, you will lack nothing. You will lack nothing, my son. I will protect you. I will make you become a man of your dream. I will train you with all my resources. I name you Ikebe Funa. Ikebe Funa. The strength of your late mother will not be a waste. And my strength, which I will use to bring you up, will not waste either. <laughs> you will not die when life is most important to you, Wab. <laughs> you will not die premature. <laughs> I bless you. I bless your destiny. I bless everything that concerns you. <laughs> no man. I mean, no man will inherit what is rightfully yours. Else, he will inherit instant death. Yes, instant death. Because you are a special child. Why? Why did you do this to me? <laughs> Save my grandson for me, Bikonunu. You are the only one that can do it. Hey, how can I sleep tonight? How can I sleep when he came in? My grandson is in the palace cell. Fear and agony 
staring at me. Why death stares at him? Hey! Ozuma never, 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 never. Hey, hey. Hey, the quick old one, the quick one, Bondu. Oh, what be a quaza? Oh, what be a quaza? Oh, what be a quaza? Ah. Oh, get it, Captain. What have I done? What have I done? God, so far, our land. I am so helpless. Who will a helpless widow like me run to? Please help me. Help one of them. Death has taken all my children away from me. Living only in Kebefna. Kebefna, my last strength. He came here for now. That's the only thing remaining for me. The only person I can call a human being in my lineage. Now they have accused him of rape. Oye kore puru. Nebedi, nebedi, unu makwezi oku. You all know the truth, my gods. Unu manezi oku no. He came here for now. He cannot do such a thing. He cannot. Hey! They want to hang an innocent child. They want to hang my grandson. They want to clear me off. What have I done? What is my wrong? Oh, they come major on who have I offended? No, I will die before they kill him. But I will just die before they kill him. Ah, 
You haven't touched your food. Why? You don't want to eat. Or you want to die here. Please eat your food, or don't come and die here. Okay? Eat something now. Uh, Ono and your co-elders in the palace, uh, we salute you too. Thank you very much. <clears throat> your Majesty, our visit to your kingdom and to your palace is like the mission of an old woman who misplaced her snuff box. All of us know what it means. She will go far and near to make sure she finds it. She will never, never leave anything unturned, including beds, clothes, boxes, everywhere. Your proverbs are always very deep. Huh? <laughs> As a matter of fact, our journey is a very sorrowful one. Your Majesty, it is no longer news that the people of the Moni Kingdom have been losing their kings on the throne. I mean, losing their kings on the throne immediately after their coronations. Very pathetic, Your Majesty. We will say that we are at the verge of correcting the errors. If at all, they are not yet corrected. We got an, uh, a woman, a priestess, who revealed to us why the things are happening. That we have been handpicking people and crowning them as our kings. But there are people we thought that the gods of the land have already chosen and approved for crowning. That at the end they will die. So she said, that a royal blooded person, son of the soil, must sit on the throne before death will stop because she had she is still seeing a lot of deaths on that throne. Certainly, that's the truth, Your Majesty. Eventually, she told us that Jamike, our late king, has a son that we never knew, and that his son. Is here in your kingdom. Yes. Uh, do we know him? I mean, if I may ask, what is his name? The Majesty, his name is Ikemefuna. Yes. He is the grandson of uh, Nedi, an old woman that fries Akara here in your kingdom. You lie! You are a blatant liar! No, 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 you don't call me a liar. Yes, that is what you are. Oh. Your Majesty, so you connived with these people to come here and tell us this nonsense. For your information, the so called Ikemefuna raped my daughter. What? Yes! He almost raped her to death. But the laws of our land have caught up with him. We are waiting for the next AK day when he will be hanged in this palace. Yes. Your Majesty, you have now confirmed my fears. 
the villagers and the youths have been saying that your daughter and Ikemefuna are going out. And because of that, you want to exonerate the boy from this crime. When it was the turn of Ekene, you did not waste time to execute him. You stripped his father of his titles. And when he could not contain it anymore and took his life, what did you do? You instructed that his body be thrown into the evil forest. And here you are, trying to exonerate a boy who raped my daughter. You can come from the east, west, north or south. I don't care. It will not stop Ikemifuna's execution come next Ikemaket day. Oh no, behave yourself. What has come over you? How dare you disrespect our king in the presence of our visitors? Better control your temper. After all, we all are in this together. Nonsense. I don't have your time now. But your highness, I will not sit down here and continue to listen to this nonsense. Uh, my people, it is very, very unfortunate that at this point we have a very sensitive matter at hand. Ike Mefuna, in question, is in our custody. Right in the palace cell, of course. Though he was accused of rape, that he raped and maimed the daughter of Ono, who just left here now. But nevertheless, I want to say, you are welcome. You see, our people used to say, and let me just put it this way, our people say that the gods do not kill anyone who his hands are clean. Of course, Ike Mifuna pleaded not guilty of such allegation or accusation. But anyhow, continue what you are saying. I want to believe my king here will have something to tell you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. you, you your Majesty, please, can I say something? Please go ahead. Go ahead. Um, Your Majesty, I know the weight of this accusation. We know what it means and we detest it. Such is a very heinous crime, even in our own kingdom. Um, Your Majesty, I want to appeal to you. I would like you to use your wisdom and give justice to this. Thank you very much. We don't need violence. Let the truth come out real. Well, um, it's all right. Uh, the gods will give us the wisdom to handle this uh, issue. Okay? Uh, you are most welcome to my kingdom. And uh, I can assure you that um, your safety is guaranteed. of your mind? Huh? I am not out of my mind. I am very sound, as you can see. Now listen, whatever they call you, princess, we are not here to see your face or anyone's face here. Now, 
get this notice. We are doing our job. We are out to search any car that passed this road. So, be a good citizen, a law-abiding person. Boys, open the boots. Obodo. Open the boots! Why will you search my car? For what? Princess! Now, me like to tell for Allah's breakfast, though. I'm sure you wouldn't like to have a taste of tea this morning. But sir, Damoto, open the boots. Why would you want to search my car? Search my car for what? Are you dead? Open the boots! Pass! Open the boots! I know what you want to do. I know that Chidi put you up to this. What happened? But let me tell you something. That Ike Mefuna will get justice. He will get justice. Oh. Yes. That is babash. Babash. And let me let you know this too. Whether Ike Mefuna or Ike Mefuna <laughs> get justice is not my business. Do you understand? But all we are doing is to make sure this kingdom is safe. Yes. Young man, can't you recognize what is on our head and show us some respect? Uh, Master, please come. Officer, I love them to Whatever they want to do, let them do. The princess is here. You mean respect? Respect indeed. What is on your head? You mean the red cap? Boy! Open that red cap. Let me see what is on his head. Nothing. <laughs> Put it back. Now, be calm or I will pull off your clothes and I will see your nakedness. Be calm. Now, get inside the car. Is it clear? You search everywhere. It's clear. Get inside your car. Now, close the door. Oh, yeah. Okay. Fast. You don't want to go? Right? Yes. You are doing a job. So, go. Be careful. You will hear from me. I will hear nothing. I will hear nothing. I'm out to do my job. I just want to make sure justice is prevailed in this kingdom. It was the king's son who raped my daughter. No, 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 please. It is not rape. They had an affair. Yes, they had an affair. And he drove her away. Or chop ya koko koko. Oku ya? We didn't know what happened, but I came. knew it. I knew Adure was not telling me the truth. The prince must have threatened to kill her if she speaks out. Oh, no. I don't know what happened. Hey! So, my grandchild is a royal blood. Adure, where are you? Adure, come on! Come and fight for your son. Your son is innocent. A hey to the throne. He's innocent. Come wherever you are. You are hearing my voice. Come and fight for your son. Let the truth be revealed. Let the truth be revealed. Everything under the sun must come to light. Every hidden secret must come to limelight for everyone to see for themselves. It's okay. Surprise! I. So you mean became a Puna is a royal blood? Yes, it is. There's no doubt about that. This is unbelievable. Huh. The cat has been let out of the bag. 
the truth is out. Let Ono Wu and his group go and hide their faces in shame and keep quiet. Let me still educate you people. The king did not state manage anything. He didn't state manage anything with us. Our people are aware that we are here. And if you people are in doubt of what we are saying, you can go and verify. Please, if people are saying the truth, we are not here to play games or hide anything. If anybody is in doubt, they can go to our kingdom to find out the truth. Ujofo, of Omoni Kingdom. I'm in a position to say the truth any time of my life. I can never say lies. Never. So everything we are telling you is true. We can't deceive you. Please. What I see is true. Yeah. Yeah. The we don't have faith in our evil again. Yes. And I will look for a way to see how he can be voted out from that throne. And his princess will leave that palace with immediate effect. Yes. He is not saying a word about Ikim's act. And that silence speaks a volume. I think he wants to strategize and look for how he will either send that boy abroad or declare him innocent. Yes. Oman me. no Buddha. That is an absolute aura. It can never happen. In this kingdom, it is not possible. Oh no. It's not possible. No way. We the youth, we are alerted. As I speak to you, we are mounting guard on the palace gates to make sure he came or anybody will never escape from that palace. I know. And at the same time, our informant inside the palace is giving us the rightful information. Nobody will escape. He came, he's still in the palace cell. Oh, but I know all that. But I don't want us to depend solely on uh, uh, an insider. He or she may be compromised. Yes. Hello. That is why we are mounting guards. Roadblocks. And searching every car that comes out of the palace. As a matter of fact, you know, no stone will be left unturned. Gee, let us talk about removing the eagle from the throne first. That man can outsmart us. You know he's a wise man. Hello. I do not have any interest on the throne. That is set for you, the Ono and the elders to decide. My primary concern is to make sure that Daddy came from of a boy will be executed before the eyes of everyone on the Kemake day. Chid, you are a true son of your father. Can you imagine that bastard snatching the princess from you? A rapist that wants to be seen walking around with the princess and they claim he's an heir to their throne i don't even want to hear that because i believe it's a setup by the Iwe so that he will declare him innocent a stupid boy that does not even know his father or his background and they're saying that he's an heir what stupid heir is that that is none of my business. AK Market Day is fast approaching. Oh no. In as much as Ekene was killed on this course, posterity must have its due course. Ekene Funa must die just the way Ekene did. That's my own. I trust you people. I know what you can do. Look, you don't have to blame her. She was doing it so that she won't be killed. Probably with you in her womb. 
She wanted to save you and herself. So you don't have to blame her. Okay? Look. Your late father was a king. And you are to sit on the throne of Umuani Kingdom. If not you, no one will succeed the throne alive. My both parents are dead. I'm sorry. I know I would die with my innocence. You will not. Okay? You will not. You will not die. I'm already feeling it. I came here for now. I am in a very precarious situation right now. I am convinced that you are innocent. But the unfortunate thing is that I cannot convince my people about it. Right from the first day I set my eyes on you, I liked you. The situation I find myself right now is that there is a law that I cannot uh, repeal because of the way the law was promulgated. It's actually a decree. And that decree stipulates death penalty by hanging on anyone found guilty of rape in my kingdom. So you see, my hands are tied. I'm sorry.
you and I know that Ikim is innocent. He didn't do it. You have to tell the elders everything. Yes, someone did it to her, but definitely not Ikim of all people. Please. I am beginning to feel very terrible right now. Chidi is instigating the youth. He's making sure that Ikim is put to death. All because of the princess is no longer interested in him anymore. He is very happy and will not stop at nothing. Neka. Neka, please. Let's tell the elders and the youth that he came is innocent. Please. Well, not we are not there. Yes, I know. But you and I know that he came cannot do such a thing. He's, he's innocent. Change is constant. People can change. Yeah, you're correct. But I strongly believe that he came is innocent. Chiyamaka is lying. She has refused to avail to the princess or anyone all in the name of she's seriously sick. Neka, please. You know he came is innocent. His grandmother is sick. She might just die before the execution. Excuse me. Neka! Neka! No. No, this is not happening. No. He came is innocent. Chiamaka is up to something. It is your offer of Omo Mikim. It is very clear that you and your fellow elders do not want to leave our land. And our Igwe here has put you in safe hands. But I want to let you know that your opinion will never count in this kingdom. This is our kingdom. It is our tradition, our norm. When you get to your own kingdom, you can make suggestions, not here. Now tell me, if it was your daughter that was raped brutally in the bush, would you be here asking for room for a trial? Yes. Uh, no, yes. Yes. You don't nail an accuse. You don't nail him or her until he or she is proved wrong beyond every reasonable doubt. Oh, will you shut up your mouth? Shut up! What? Yes. Your Majesty, have you heard him? Have you heard him insulting me because I came to your kingdom? Calm down, please. Calm Did down. I come here to fight you? Mbanonu. Huh? It's not good for you to insult our visitor. Like that. You asked him a question. And he answered you. Why then the insult? It's not good. You have him. Well, uh, the Majesty, I respect your thoughts. Uh, it's well. All I appeal for is for you to use the discretions and do the needful. Thank you very much. And uh, please, uh, no, I know you are paying debt equally because it's considerate. Thank you, Your Majesty. Um, Ojofo, I want to thank you. I want to appreciate the fact that uh, you identified with what uh, Maono is passing through. Okay, and you were able to calm down. Thank you. Thank you very much, Your Majesty. And uh, Ono, mm -hmm. I want to appeal to you. Please, calm down. Okay? Uh, I share in your pain. 
and we do everything possible to ensure that we get to the root of this matter. Yes. All right? Uh, you know, in our kingdom, we always say it, that uh, we will not perfect justice. And uh, my decision on this matter is that the accused must be given fair trial yeah. Yeah. after carrying out due diligence. I have spoken. Thank you very much. Mas, you are welcome. Thank you very much. How is she faring? Her temperature is still high. Hi. Thank God you are back with the mercy. Mm. Let me go and get a glass of water so that she can take the mess. Uh, yes, yes, yes. No. My grandson is my medicine. No amount of medication can cure my pain. Is my cure. I want to see Kevin for now. No, the man. You will see him certainly, but you have to remain alive, be alive, so that you'll be able to see him. Please take your medicine now. Hmm? One of you. Be cool. The boy is heartless. He's wicked, unlike his daughter. I dreamt that he killed. My grandson. I know he will kill him. But I'd rather die before he does that. I'd rather die. The world is very wicked. They can do or do. They don't care who dies or who lives. They don't care who misses you or whatever. The world is wicked. You know, you are right. But what we are saying, it can be an issue at this point. You need to take your medicine to be alive. Bikunu. I want to see my grandson return to me alive. That's the only medicine I need. Mazi, well, let us wait for Jofo. I believe you come back here with good news. I believe so too. I know the gods of our land will make it possible for us to go home with our heir to the throne. Just take your medicine. A hen that enters a new land walks with one leg up. Yeah, you're right. But I can see that both of you are protected by a strong covering in this palace. And I shall laugh at both of you tomorrow when the chief priest will confirm your heir to the throne of Umo the kingdom, a stupid rapist. And come next a key market day, his head will not be on his body. Mark my word, it is not about hatred. It's about justice. Uh, uh, come here. No, no, no. Oh, no. We shouldn't be enemies because of all this now. Eh? Even if it happens so, we take it as our fate. We will not run away from, 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 from our land. What kind of stupidity is that? And we are calling you, you are calling up. You, you, you just imagine him. Why would you say that our, our, our kingdom is a stupid kingdom? Who are you? Is your kingdom better than ours? At all. Dingo. You are lucky you walked away. Else I would have told you something you will regret all your life. Idiot. Just imagine. It's okay. 
Let's go. No. So what is it? In as much as we don't support rape, that we frown and that we don't encourage rape. Don't you think we have to have another plan? But what have just happened here? I think we should have alternative plan. What if? There is nothing, nothing like a what if. Mm -hmm. Just erase that clause. What if? I don't want to hear it. I will do that, but listen to me first. I'm listening. Good. It seems you've forgotten what the chief princess told us when we are coming to this. Yes. Kingdom. Can you remind me? Good. She said about the dark cloud. Sorrow. Agony. Remember, the old woman is already sick. And she's lamenting non-stop. This thing is getting out of hand though. I think we should have plan B. Because it's like a supply that is pitching on our scrub uh, to me. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. The gods of our land mm -hmm. are with us in this journey. Mm -hmm. I am not troubled in my heart. Not at all. Because right now, mm. I have not seen nor have a feeling of any biasness in anything. Mm. Do you get me? Now listen. Mm. Ike Mefula mm. is innocent. Okay. So do not be afraid. Erase fears in your heart. We will go home successfully with Ike Mefula. So delete every fear in your heart. Do not be afraid. Your Majesty, whoever killed my daughter will be found and be punished. My king, your majesty. <laughs> your majesty, I can't hold this anymore. I can't hold this anymore. <laughs> Our loved ones are dying. The other day, our kids was raped to death brutally. <laughs> and yet nothing is being done. My king. Do something. Do something. Do something about it before we lose everyone. Please. Please, Your Majesty. Please. Just do something. Our guests can no longer go to bed with their two eyes closed. This, this, this things are getting out of hand. There is no other person we can beckon on as it is now. Please, Your Majesty. Please. Well, um, I've heard you, my people. This is not happening for the first time. But our people say that many days are for the thief. But one day, one day is for the owner. The incessant raping of our daughters is getting out of hands. And we are tired of crying, mourning, and burying our dead. But one thing I can assure you, justice must prevail. Whoever that is perpetrating this evil will be caught one day. I am going to hold a meeting with my cabinet members. I will put something in place to ensure that the perpetrator or perpetrators are caught. So please, 
I feel your pains. I share in your anger. Go home. Go home. And rest. Why have you refused to eat? She's hanging on. Hanging on more than you. And I. My mom may not survive before my execution. We can't say that. There is hope. Look, an external chief press is coming to vindicate you. Yeah. You're going to be free, yes. Yes. All thanks to the elders of your kingdom. They will say you're really wise and smart. They changed the whole scary situation. So all we have to do now is to await the chief breast. But I still don't feel like there is hope. Shh. Stop it. There is hope. Okay. You will be vindicated. You will. So. I'm sorry too. I'm sorry. It's okay. But there's a bad news. What happened? Nika. One of the palace maiden. She's dead. Dead. We found her corpse by the roadside. I don't know, but people said her death has something to do with this. This issue is a delicate one. And the reason is simple. It has to do with a human life. If you don't tell us the truth, I will make wrong decision. It will be irreversible and irreparable. So please, our daughter, Tell us the truth. On the day you were raped, did you see Ikeme Funa? Can you confirm that it was Ikeme Funa that raped you? Please tell us the truth. Yes, Your Majesty. Ikeme Funa raped me. He abused me. He beat me and almost choked me to death. I was screaming, trying to help myself away from him. But he overpowered me and he raped me right in the bush. Chiamaka, you have heard it from His Majesty. We want you to tell us nothing but the truth. Ike Mefuna made it clear to us that he met you 
in the bush unconscious. Is it true? Or uh, were you paid to accuse him? With all due respect, Your Majesty, I cannot sit here and allow anybody to intimidate my daughter. She has said that Ikemefula raped her. Or do you want to put words into her mouth? For goodness sake, Ikemefula raped my daughter! No, we take it easy. It's okay. It's okay. Um, Chair, you can leave. You can leave. Um, we've all heard what she said, right? The only thing we can do now is to wait on Ezemo to confirm the authenticity of uh, what she told us, okay? So I strongly suggest that uh, we calm down, you know, so that uh, we wait for that verdict. Is that clear? Why are you elders of Umwani anxious to know the truth? The heir to the throne has been accused. Oh. I see everything. Mm. Doubt is fear. And fear is unbelief. Uncertainty breeds fear. <clears throat> you want to know if he's going to be killed or not. <clears throat> Victory or failure. Futility or success. Mm. Yes, wise one. The kingdom have opened their mouth to eat him up. For it is by wisdom one kills the fly that perches beneath his scrotum. A man does not go to another man's house to fight him unprepared. For whatever he believes is what he gets. Wise one, we believe the heir to the throne of this kingdom is innocent. Are we right or wrong? Hmm. Hmm. Near death. Near death. Men are folly in their decisions. You have two market dates. Two dates. That's all you have left. Mm. <clears throat> and an elderly man clears his throat. The spirits listen. It's recording. It is said that when it happens to the eyes, it happens to the nose. Nambo, ono. But uh, I'll go. <laughs> One does not sleep with a log of wood in his eyes. 
Ghosts of our land. We still call upon you. Because we cannot do without you. Yes. We pray that our journey to the other kingdom will not be in vain. He said. We shall not return to Umoni kingdom in shame. He said. We therefore implore you, O gods of Umoni kingdom, protect and guide us. In a strange land that we have visited. Tomorrow, may our son, Ikemefula, be vindicated. May you take us home safely with Ikemefula tomorrow. All this we ask and we believe that the gods of our land must answer us. The old woman is not sleeping. She is very worried. I can hear her whisper. Yes, you are correct. She is praying to her chi. Tomorrow is very heavy. Because it is judgment day. Our hearts are panting in our palms. Hmm. Hmm. It is so long. It refused to break. The priestess. Refused to say anything to your people, right? It was all in riddles. I knew it. I understand. This is like life and death. The people of this land want Ikemefla dead. But the people of Umoni Kingdom want him to leave. If we miss him, if we miss him, I don't know the fate of Umoni Kingdom. Hmm. Hmm. Ojofo of Umoni Kingdom, you have spoken to our ancestors over four times today. Please, go in and rest your head. Resting the head is like calming the mind. Does a man go chasing the rats when his abode is on fire? Mm -hmm. Oh, dear four, don't worry. The gods will give us victory. You see... It sadly looks like the worst night of my life. I can't sleep. 
I have died many times. I am dead. Go back to your chamber. Rest your head and sleep. The gods of our land would vindicate Ikemefuna. Yes, the gods who did not allow your little evil king to flush out Ikemefuna from his mother's womb is still alive. He can never be forgiven wherever he is for putting us through into this predicament. Amen. How is your health? My health? A man who just recovered from an illness and his son dies. How is he healthy? As you can see, I am not fine. I am now whispering like a new mad woman in the market square who has just lost her children in a day. Now that music and why put our love for We know how you feel. Please. The gods will never let you be in shame. <laughs> there is no secret under the sun. Light and darkness do not meet. Likewise, truth and falsehood can never agree. The gods have revealed that you raped her. There is no need for too much talk. The gods have vindicated my daughter. Ikem is a rapist. A useless one at that. What are we waiting for? Your majesty, pass your judgment. Please, fix a date for Ikem to be executed. Yes. Your Majesty, I... Eh? Please, this is a moment of judgment. Tell him. <laughs> well, uh, it might interest you to know that I am not convinced by what the Ezemo said a few minutes ago. What is it? Yes. Consequently, I am not passing any judgment on Ikemefuna. Your Majesty! He is the Majesty, the King. He has the final say. I'm going to speak to you. 
this place. But the gods have posted everywhere. I don't know what to do. I don't know. Please, put that smile on for me. This is beyond me. It's beyond me. It will pull me down. If I do anything against the will of the people. I know you can do something. But the king cannot die. You know that. And you know. Look, if I go down, you go down. You should know that. You know I love you so much. I can do anything for you. But this is beyond me. Please, please, please. You bury him in your land when they finally kill him. Kebefuda is a great boy. He always wished to know where he came from. Me, our people are coming to take you to our kingdom tomorrow. Kebefuda must not die. We are going to cry him. The king of Umu and the kingdom tomorrow. See, what happened has happened. Hmm? But I am happy that justice has finally prevailed. Yes. I don't want anything to affect your health. It's okay. But let them wait and see how the head of that their stupid hair will be cut off tomorrow in this kingdom. Hmm. I am happy that the gods have proved them 
and his majesty wrong. The boy will be killed tomorrow and his useless body will be thrown into the evil forest. In this land, we will not allow them to carry his body to the kingdom. I have to be on my way now. It's okay. Thank you. Just to run. I know a place that we can follow. We're not going to get caught, okay? Just, just, um, you know what? Go and hide over there. Hide, okay? I'm coming. Achebe! Achebe! Please come. Appreciate it. Why do you want to disgrace me? Why do you want to humiliate me? I'm sorry, my prince. You are sorry? What is it? Why did you call me? My prince, I don't know what to do anymore. I'm scared. I'm confused. She's been asking me what's wrong with me. And what did you tell her? Adore, what did you tell her? Listen to me, Adore. If you dare mention my name, I swear to the gods, I will kill you. I will have my God strangle you to death. Obele. Come. Go to my chamber. You will see an envelope, a very big envelope, filled with money. Bring it, and when you do, hand it over to her. Now listen and listen attentively. That money will be enough for you to flee from this kingdom. I do not want to see you or anything that looks like you in my father's kingdom. Else, 
I will have your head. Do you understand me? Do you understand me, Adure? Yes, my prince. Good. Very good. Adure, I know you love your mother very much. If you ever mention my name anywhere, I swear I will kill your mother and I will kill you too. Don't say I did not warn you. Don't say I didn't warn you. You know how dangerous it is to play with me. Don't! Adure, fight for your son. Mm. Unravel the hidden truth. The king does not die in a strange land. Instead, let heads roll. Hmm. 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 Fight! Ikemefuna, as the owner of this kingdom, I ask you to make your last wish. Which bush in particular? Ngele. That is where he sets his trap. Almost everyone is aware of that. Oh. I see. <laughs> what is it? What do you want to do? No! Hey, get the come here! You sent for me. What is the problem? Why are you instigating the youths of this kingdom? You even pay them on a daily to hunt the palace. Why? <laughs> oh, that? As a matter of fact, I am not hunting the palace. I'm only making sure that he came does not escape from the palace. That is enough. You have to stop now. Who the heck are you to give me instruction on when to stop? Oh, because you're my informant, right? If you do not stop, I will tell the Igwe and the villagers that you raped me. Yes. I don't know about Ikem's ordeal, but I am 100% sure that you are behind it. So you have to stop now, else I will confess everything to them. You raped me, Sachidi. You did. Uh, it's okay, I... I promise you, I... I will stop. Yeah, sure. I will stop, yeah. Ah! <laughs> 
Man, you bribed the maiden to accuse an innocent person of rape. Evil man. What are you talking about? The gods can never tell lies. Be careful so that you don't incur the wrath of the gods. I, I, yeah, as am I. Yes, I, 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 I did it. Please, I, I want you to cover me up. Trust me, if you cover me up, I'll give you the sum of 500,000 Naira. Please. May the gods forbid. Evil man, how dare you? I'm chosen by the gods to speak the truth. You are full of evil. All right, uh, Okay, I, I understand. 500,000 Naira is very small. I'll make it one million naira. I have it cash in my car right now. One million naira. Cash? Oh, yes. Cash. Ezema, please. All I want to do for me, just point your finger to that prisoner. If you don't defend me, I will be hanged. Please, let him go in place of me. Then you give me two million. Two million. Uh, uh, okay, fine. I, I, I agree. I, two million naira. I'll give you two million naira. But what I have right now in my car is one million naira. Okay? I'll give the one million naira. As soon as you're done with the deal, I'll give the balance of one million naira. Trust me, I will do it. The boy is a royal blood. I've seen it in the spirit. His name has just been revealed to me. It will take two infants to die for me to cover these secrets. Okay. It is not an easy task to kill a royal blood. I hope you know that. Yeah, yeah, sure. I, I know. Quiet! She Quiet, everyone! As you can see, my great people of the Allah Kingdom, he came from here. He's innocent. Consequently, he has been declared a free man. Oh no, you are the number two citizen of this kingdom. You swore to an oath of allegiance to the king and indeed the kingdom. In as much as I appreciate the fact that you did what you did because of your love for your daughter, and because your daughter lied to you, the requirements of our offices demand that we work in harmony. For you to revolt against the king and disgrace the king in the presence of visitors is unacceptable. Consequently, you are hereby removed as you know of this kingdom. Igwe, the heart of a man is always with his children. 
it was only natural that I did what I did. No father will be comfortable seeing his daughter raped ruthlessly in the bush. Yes. I swore an oath of allegiance to you. And, uh, I want to say that I take full responsibility for my actions. The interest of this kingdom supersedes every other interest. And on that note, Igwe, I want to say that I am very sorry. I'm sorry. Eh, from the depth of my heart, please forgive me, Biko. Please. Chiamaka. Eh? Chiamaka. Yes. Chiamaka, read my lips. How many times I call you? Three. Three good times, right? Yes, sir. Fine. Let's not stretch this. Hmm? Okay. I did what I did for justice to be served. Is that okay? Get that into your head. I know, Biko. Oh, but, oh, 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 Chidi has scattered you. Now turn you up and down. Hey. Front and back. Back and front. And your lover, I mean your almighty lover who came, who you tried to kill, is now a king. You can't even try and step to his level. So you are coming back to me, Obudu. Let me have you back. It can't work. It can't work. Your case is over. It seems you are smoking something. Ah. Your brain is skipping. Mba. Please. Mwabu Obodo. Obodo no eri Obodo. Abu Molodo. Please. I don't have any business to do with you. Obodo, please. I have something to go and do. Please. Let me go and hustle. Excuse me. Obodo, Biko. Obodo, wait, please. Obodo, Biko, wait. Wait, please. Wait, please. Wait, please. Wait, please. Wait, please. We are so happy for you. We appreciate everything you have done for us. Since you came, it's about one year now. And we have been very peaceful. Umoni Kingdom has witnessed the kind of peace and joy they never witnessed before. There has not been deaths. There have not been deaths. They have, we, we have been progressing in everything we do. So we wish to thank you so much. Thank you. And may the gods of our land of Umonaji bless you. Wise one, I will send for my guests to bring you your gift. 
Thank you very much for all you have done. Thank you so much, Your Majesty. May your reign be peaceful. May you reign in authority. May there be multiple fruits on your table. May you reign forever. Thank you so much, Your Majesty. I take my leave now. Your Majesty. You go about this here. My Majesty. My father? My father is here. Thank you. 